Hi my days, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing an album reaction of Young K's uh, solo mini album, Eternal. I'm super, super excited to get into this. Um, absolutely loved Guard You. Um, so I'm, I think there's six other songs we're gonna hear today um, that I know are gonna be just as amazing as Guard You was. Uh, this is actually like the first album reaction I've done with anything related to day six. I thought I was going to do the right through me um, album reaction first, but um, since I got to this one first, this is going to be the first one I decided to do. So um, the first one we have up is best song. So I'm really excited to get, get into this. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get started. so good um literally whoever ends up marrying this guy so so fortunate like can you imagine i bet he he would write the the best songs the best songs uh, i noticed this with stray kids but i'm also noticing it with young k and like day six and even of day um 
and I know Young K writes his own music, but amazing lyricists, absolutely amazing lyricists. They do a spectacular job. Um, and I know it's not a direct translation to English um, because you, you lose some of that uh, translating it between languages. You lose some of the emotion and some of the like raw uh, like wording um, translating between languages. Um, but even still, amazing job. Absolutely amazing. That, that you can just like feel the emotion in their words and it's just very poetic so um love the song this is this is so good this is such a good intro song um so the next one i'm gonna get to is i think it's not gonna love yeah because we already heard guard you so i'm gonna go ahead and skip that one and go to not gonna love so let's go ahead and get into this I really like the sound of that one. Um, that one definitely had a very different feel from uh, the first song. This one gave me more of a guard you feel. But I loved his flow in this one. Uh, there were some parts of it that felt very uh, like staccato. Um, which kind of gave it that like rap feel without it actually being rap. But I know he, um, I don't know about their, like, later music. I know in, like, Right Through Me there wasn't rap. But, uh, 
I know he used to be like the rapper of the group because I know in congratulations he rapped but um and I think he can do that because he he was or still I don't know if like if he's just like no longer taking that title or if he still has y'all let me know but um but I, he can do that um I feel because he did rap for the group but I really liked the sound of the chorus, like the I'm not going to love part, the English part. Um, it sounded like he was singing through, what is it, a, a bullhorn? It kind of gave that like that kind of feel. Love, love, love when he goes into his higher register. It sounds so good, like so, so good. I really like this song. This song gave me more of like a rock feel. So. But the next song we have Microphone. There wasn't really like a lyric lyric video for this one. So um, this one uh, looks a little different in regards to the lyric video. But I think it's still um, a pretty good translation. Um, I'm not 100% sure because I don't know what the translation would be. But um, I'm going to assume it's still a pretty good translation. So with that being said, let's go ahead and get into microphone. Okay, I don't know if I've ever talked about this on my channel. I probably have when it comes to Young K. 
But he's got such a comforting voice. Like that that song made me feel good. Um, made me feel okay. I really liked the one the part where he goes into his lower register. Also like this the spoken word part where it just sounds like he's just talking into the mic. And then the little, after the I'll be your microphone part, the little mms, uh, it's very faint, but it's uh, so, so pretty. But yeah, this song was just like warm and comforting and just very, very nice. Uh, I know it's, uh, it's featuring DVWN, like my first initial thought is to say Dawn but I I know there is a Dawn in the K-pop industry and I don't think that's how he like spells his name I'm not 100% sure I'm not too familiar with Dawn but um yeah it's just this was so good it was so comforting So, um, the next one is Want to Love You. And I think one of y'all said Sungmin is a big fan of this song. And Sungmin and I have very similar taste in music. So if Sungmin is a really big fan of this song, I probably will also be a really big fan of this song. So let's go ahead and get into Want to Love You. 